Excellency, the Ambassador of Kyrgyzstan, Irina Sotorbayev. And we have three questions for you. Uh, my first question is, actually, first I would like to congratulate you on having the logo, since you are one of the only countries in the region that right now has a logo of national branding. Uh, it's amazing. Congratulations. I know my first question, how do you plan to implement Kyrgyzstan's national brand in the international spheres? And what are the next steps into strengthening Kyrgyzstan's uh, national brand? Yes, well, uh, thank you for the question. Um, uh, uh, so as I uh, mentioned before, it's uh, very, very uh, important for uh, our uh, country, our nation, to mm, to uh, to get uh, into the situation that we can make our country more popular, uh, ignoble in 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 a bigger world. And uh, 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 as I told before, we use any possibility to 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 use this uh, logo of uh, Kyrgyzstan in our official meetings or in uh, another ways and it's uh, it is uh, uh, it is very uh, used intensively uh, by our touristic companies uh, tourist uh, uh, operators uh, uh, and uh, uh, our touristic companies uh, uh, are particip participating in a bigger, uh, um, uh, b bigger touristic uh, conferences, uh, places like ITB in Berlin and uh, some others in Asia also. Uh, so it's uh, it's uh, we are good in the beginning to 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 extend uh, this information uh, about Kyrgyzstan using the logo, which focusing on a national uh, culture and tradition. Um, thank you very much, Your um, Excellency. Um, I mean, Kyrgyzstan is doing a pretty good job for such a young nation. And I'm wondering, um, is Kyr Kyrgyzstan, are the people of Kyrgyzstan ready for tourism and tourists as far as national uh, language is concerned and the the touch with an uh, international people in terms of can they speak other languages have they um, how developed is the tourism sector in that in that aspect so languages is very interesting uh, uh, questions uh, a question are in Kyrgyzstan uh, like also in Kazakhstan as I know we're using uh, since we grow we grow up with uh, two languages. The native language uh, uh, for us is Kyrgyz, and uh, uh, another language for official use is Russian. Uh, so uh, we in Kyrgyzstan we have uh, running two languages, two languages, and everybody understand it. And uh, uh, it is uh, 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 also very, very important for interethnical uh, communication in Kyrgyzstan. We have a uh, representative of, uh, of uh, 80, yes, 80 nation nationalities uh, in Kyrgyzstan. Uh, um, most of them, they, they, they can speak uh, uh, Kyrgyz, uh, the state language. Uh, but uh, uh, in use is also Russian as, uh, uh, as the in in interethnic uh, communication language. Um, do you do you sorry? Do you think that this is an area that the people of Kyrgyzstan need to um, develop in order to support the tourism sector in terms of learning the new languages, maybe the languages of the countries which you are specifically targeting, for example, other Asian languages? or English? Yes, uh, uh, it is. Uh, um, uh, uh, since our in the in the in the in the <laughs> 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 a little tired. Since our <laughs> independence is, is t since uh, 25 years, uh, uh, we are developing or, or we, we make efforts for developing uh, uh, English in our country and uh, it is not, uh, I would say it is not uh, 
it is not heavy task for us uh, uh, as i know uh, young people in uh, in in all the world around the world they, they use the english language and uh, our students uh, for example or, or our schoolers they, they use uh, they learn english english and uh, they are using it uh, 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 with a meaning and understanding that it's, uh, it is very, very uh, important for the future and uh, uh, for the contacts with the, with the big world and uh, uh, it is very supportive for us uh, 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 for uh, it's very supportive for us uh, uh, in uh, for, for uh, developing of tourism also and i would say uh, uh, other european languages maybe german you will find you will find a uh, very good group of young people uh, people in kyrgyzstan which are using german which can speak german and uh, uh, our big num uh, uh, big uh, uh, neighbor is uh, uh, is uh, china is China and uh, meanwhile we have good group of uh, Kyrgyz younger uh, people which uh, which has studied in China and using uh, China language. Uh, so and uh, tourists uh, from China are also very important, and uh, we have tourists from China also to Kyrgyzstan. Thank you very much for your reply. Um, the ad Ambassador, a final short question for you. Traditionally, Central Asian states have been focusing on hard power. However, now uh, there's a shift towards the soft power outlook. How do you see this trend in the Kyrgyz state and foreign policy department? Yes, uh <laughs> Uh, hard and soft power maybe not uh, not the right word uh, uh, for Kyrgyzstan. Uh, Kyrgyzstan has own interests, and Kyrgyzstan is very very friendly country, and Kyrgyzstan is interested uh, um, to stay in contact and to develop uh, a bilateral multilateral relationship uh, with the world, uh, 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 focusing from own interests. And uh, uh, of course, uh, the first uh, priority is our, our neighbor, neighboring countries in Central Asia, so our neighbors, and uh, uh, it's uh, first prior priority to uh, to keep to develop uh, the very very uh, good relations with the neighbors and. Uh, uh, another pri priority uh, uh, to to use uh, the best practices uh, 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 from neighbors, from the bigger world, from Europe, for example, uh, uh, t for the further dev uh, dev uh, development in Kyrgyzstan on the right way. In Kyrgyzstan, I mentioned in my presentation, you have uh, maybe like in Kazakhstan, uh, 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 f former nomadic people with nomadic culture, uh, we are very, very open-minded people. We are very, very open to the world, and uh, uh, this this might be the, the the biggest the biggest interesting interesting in element in our uh, countries, uh, and uh, I think uh, it is also the good base to make good foreign policy.